Atlanta has a thriving music industry and is considered to be a capital of hip-hop, including crunk, of R&B, and its offshoot neo-soul, and of gospel music. In addition to a thriving indie rock and live music scene, classical, country and blues have historically been well represented. In 2009, the New York Times called Atlanta, hip-hop center of gravity, and the city is home to many popular hip-hop and R&B musicians. So let's take a look at the women who put Atlanta on the music scene. Escape is an American girl group from Atlanta, Georgia, formed in 1991 by Candy Boris, Tamika, Tiny, Harris, Latoka Scott, Tamara Coggins, and Tamika Scott. The following year, Coggins left the group and Escape became a quartet. They were discovered by Jermaine Dupri, who signed the group to his So So Deaf label. The group released their debut album, Hum and Komen at Cha in 1993, which spawned two of their biggest hits, Just Kickin' It and Understand It. The album was certified platinum on February 1, 1994. Escape has sold more than 7 million records worldwide. The group went on to release their second album, Off the Hook in 1995, and was certified platinum on November 1995. The lead single, Feels So Good, and Who Can I Run To, were both certified gold in the United States. Their third and final album, Traces of My Lipstick, was released in 1998. The lead single, The Arms of the One Who Loves You, was certified gold on May 14, 1998, and the album was certified platinum on June 21, 1999, in the United States. The group disbanded in 1998 to pursue solo projects and reformed in 2017. On June 25, 2017, the original four group members had their first performance together in over 18 years at the 2017 Bet Awards. They would also perform at the Essence Festival and at Cheen Park in Detroit. In 2022, the group was awarded the Lady of Soul at the 2022 Soul Train Awards. TLC is an American girl group formed in Atlanta, Georgia in 1990. The group's best-known lineup was composed of Tioni, T. Boz, Watkins, Rosanda, Chili, Thomas, and Lisa Left Eye Lopez. The group enjoyed success during the 1990s, with nine top ten hits on the Billboard Hot 100, including four number one singles, Creep, Waterfalls, no Scrubs, and Unpretty. The group also recorded four multi-platinum albums, including Crazy Sexy Cool in 1994, which received a diamond certification from the Recording Industry Association of America. TLC also became the first R&B group in history to receive the million certification from the Recording Industry Association of Japan for fan mail in 1999. Having sold over 65 million records worldwide, TLC is the best-selling American girl group. VH1 ranked TLC as the greatest female group, placing them at number 12 on the list of 100 greatest women in music. Billboard magazine ranked TLC as one of the greatest musical trios, as well as the seventh most successful act of the 1990s. The group's accolades include four career Grammy Awards, five MTV Video Music Awards, and five Soul Train Music Awards. Twenty years after their debut, TLC was honored with an award called Outstanding Contribution to Music at the 17th MOBO Awards and with the Legend Award at the 2013 MTV Video Music Awards, Japan. On April 25, 2002, Lopez died in a car crash while filming a documentary in Honduras, following her death, instead of replacing her the remaining members chose to continue as a duo. In 2017, they released their eponymous fifth album, TLC. In 2022, the group was inducted into the Black Music Walk of Fame. Monica is an American singer, rapper, and actress. Born and raised in College Park, Georgia, she began performing as a child and became part of a traveling gospel choir at the age of 10. Monica rose to prominence after she signed with Rowdy Records in 1993 and released her debut album, Miss Thang. She followed it with a series of successful albums, including the global bestseller The Boy Is Mine in 1998, as well as the number one albums After the Storm in 2003 
the makings of me in 2006, and still standing, in 2010. Throughout her career, several of Monica's singles became number one hits on the pop and R&B charts, including Before You Walk Out of My Life, Don't Take It Personal, Just One of Dem Days, Like This and Like That, The Boy Is Mine, With Brandy, The First Night, Angel of Mine, So Gone and everything to me. Monica has sold 5.3 million albums in the United States, and she is recognized as one of the most successful urban R&B female vocalists to begin a career in the mid to late 1990s. According to Billboard, she is the youngest recording act to ever have two consecutive chart-topping hits on the Billboard Top R&B Singles chart, as well as the first artist to top the US Billboard Hot R&B and Hip Hop Songs chart over the span of three consecutive decades 1990, 2000, and 2010. In 2010, Billboard listed Monica at number 24 on its list of the top 50 R&B and Hip Hop artists of the past 25 years. A four-time nominee, she won a Grammy Award for Best R&B Performance by a Duo or Group with Vocals for her contribution to The Boy Is Mine alongside Brandy. At the 41st Awards Ceremony, and has been the recipient of one Billboard Music Award, one BET Award, and two BMI Pop Awards. Gladys Knight, born in Atlanta, Georgia, known as the Empress of Soul, is an American singer, songwriter, actress, and businesswoman. A seven-time Grammy Award winner, Knight recorded hits through the 1960s, 1970, and 1980 with her family group, Gladys Knight and the Pips, which included her brother Merrold, Bubba Knight, and cousins William Guest and Edward Patton. Knight has recorded two number one Billboard Hot 100 singles, Midnight Train to Georgia, and That's What Friends Are For, which she did with Dionne Warwick, Sir Elton John, and Stevie Wonder, 11 number one R&B singles, and six number one R&B albums. She has won seven Grammy Awards, four as a solo artist, and three with the Pips, and is an inductee into the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame and Vocal Group Hall of Fame along with the Pips. Two of her songs, I Heard It Through the Grapevine and Midnight Train to Georgia were inducted into the Grammy Hall of Fame for historical, artistic, and significant value. She also recorded the theme song for the 1989 James Bond film License to Kill. Rolling Stone magazine ranked Knight among the 100 greatest singers of all time. Kelly Rowland, born in Atlanta, Georgia, is an American singer, actress, and television personality. She rose to fame in the late 1990s as a member of Destiny's Child, one of the world's best-selling girl groups of all time. During the group's three-year hiatus, Roland released her debut solo studio album, Simply Deep in 2002, which debuted at number one on the UK Albums Chart and sold over three million copies worldwide. It included the Billboard Hot 100 number one single, Dilemma, with Nelly, as well as the UK top five hits, Stole and Can't Nobody. Roland also ventured into acting, with starring roles in the successful films Freddy vs. Jason and The Seat Filler. Throughout her career, Roland has sold over 40 million records as a solo artist, and a further 60 million records with Destiny's Child. Her work has earned her several awards and nominations, including five Grammy Awards, one Billboard Music Award, and two Soul Train Music Awards. Roland also received a star on the Hollywood Walk of Fame as part of Destiny's Child, and as a solo artist. She has been honored by the American Society of Composers, Authors, and Publishers, in essence, for her contributions to music. In 2014, Fuse ranked her in their 100 Most Award-Winning Artists. Carrie Hilson is an American R&B singer, songwriter, and actress. She was born and raised in Decatur, Georgia, and spent most of her youth working with producer Anthony Dent as a songwriter and background vocalist for several R&B and hip-hop artists. She attended Oxford College of Emory University in Georgia while she continued writing songs for artists including Britney Spears, The Pussycat Dolls, and Mary J. Blige, with the production and songwriting team The Clutch. In 2006, Hilson signed with American producer and rapper Timbaland's record label Mosley Music. 
Her breakthrough came in 2007, after appearing on Timbaland's single The Way I Are, which topped charts around the world. Hilson's music style is R&B, hip-hop, and pop. Womanhood, sexual intimacy, and love are the typical themes. Her musical influences come from her father's side of the family. Hilson's debut studio album, In a Perfect World, was released in 2009 and debuted at number 4 on the US Billboard 200 chart, eventually being certified gold by the Recording Industry Association of America. The album spawned the hit singles, Knock You Down, featuring Kanye West and Me Yo, Turnin' Me On, featuring Lil Wayne, and I Like. It also earned Hilson two Grammy Award nominations for Best New Artist and Best Rap or Sung Collaboration for Knock You Down. In 2012, Hilson made her acting debut in the romantic comedy film Think Like a Man. Her achievements include a BET Award, MOBO Award, Knock Image Award, and two Soul Train Music Awards. Brenda Lee, born in Atlanta, Georgia, is an American singer, performing rock, pop, and country music. She had 47 U.S. chart hits during the 1960s and is ranked fourth in that decade, surpassed only by Elvis Presley, The Beatles, and Ray Charles. She is known for her 1960 hit, I'm Sorry, and 1958, Rockin' Around the Christmas Tree, which has become a Christmas standard. She received the nickname Lil Miss Dynamite in 1957 after recording the song Dynamite when she was 12 and was one of the earliest pop stars to have a major contemporary international following. In 1969, Lee returned to the charts with her recording Johnny one time. The song reached number 3 on Billboard's adult contemporary chart and number 41 on the Billboard Hot 100. The song also earned Lee her second Grammy nomination for Best Pop Female Vocal. Later success came with a return to her roots as a country singer, with a string of hits through the 1970s and 1980. Lee has sold more than 100 million records worldwide. She is a member of the rock and roll, country music, and rockabilly halls of fame. She is also a Grammy Lifetime Achievement Award recipient. Lee is the first woman to be inducted into both the rock and roll and country music halls of fame. Normani, an American singer and dancer, born in Atlanta, Georgia. She auditioned as a solo act for the American television series The X Factor in 2012, after which she became a member of the girl group Fifth Harmony, which went on to become one of the best-selling girl groups of all time. While in Fifth Harmony, Normani competed in Dancing with the Stars 2027, and released her first song outside of the group, Love Lies, in 2018, duet with Khalid. The song peaked in the top 10 in the US, was certified five times platinum by Recording Industry Association of America, and is tied as the longest charting song by a female artist on the mainstream top 40 chart. Following Fifth Harmony's indefinite hiatus, Normani released a two-song EP with Calvin Harris. Normani and Calvin Harris in 2018. That same year, she released the single Waves featuring Six Lack, which won Normani the MTV Video Music Award for Best R&B Video. Her duet with Sam Smith, Dancing with a Stranger, 2019, is one of the most streamed songs by a female artist in the United Kingdom, and earned her a nomination for Song of the Year at the Brit Awards. In August 2019, she released her first solo single, Motivation. The following year, she released Diamonds with Megan Thee Stallion for Birds of Prey, the album. In July 2021, Normani released Wild Side, featuring Cardi B, which reached the top 20 in the US. Lauren Elena is an American singer and songwriter from Rossville, Georgia. She was the runner-up on the 10th season of American Idol. Her debut studio album, Wildflower, was released on October 2011. Her second album, Road Less Traveled, was released January 2017. Elena later achieved her first number one on the country airplay chart with the album's title track. Her second number one came later that year, when she simultaneously topped five Billboard charts with her friend and former classmate Kane Brown on their duet, What Ifs. Her third studio album, Sitting Pretty on Top of the World, was released on September 2021. In December 2021, 
Elena was invited by Trisha Yearwood to become a member of the Grand Ole Opry. She was inducted by Yearwood during the Opry performance on February 2022. Ma Rainey, born in Columbus, Georgia, was an American blues singer and influential early blues recording artist. Dubbed the mother of the blues, she bridged earlier vaudeville and the authentic expression of southern blues, influencing a generation of blues singers. Rainey also collaborated with Thomas Dorsey, Tampa Red, and Louis Armstrong, and toured and recorded with the Georgia Jazz Band. She has been posthumously inducted into the Blues Hall of Fame, as well as the Rock and Roll Hall of Fame, and has been portrayed in several films, including the 2020 Academy Award-winning Netflix film Ma Rainey's Black Bottom. Other notable female artists are Chloe and Haley, Rashida and Big Lado. Thank you for watching my channel. Subscribe for more informative content.